Here at The Room, we have so many fun personalities. So for 2013, we thought we would introduce them to you through our video tasting notes. Stay tuned at the end of this video for upcoming events at The Room. So here's the boys tasting our 2011 Barrel Fermented Chardonnay and our 2010 Sangiovese. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Cheers, Jake. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. All right, guys, we're starting with 2011 Barrel Fermented Chardonnay. Burgundian in style, but still New World. So you get a little bit of citrus peel, some fig, maybe a little bit of apple and pear. It's just really well balanced for it too. Yes. Has a nice creaminess to it. Yeah. Um, so we're, you know, it's just a nice, impressive Chardonnay, I believe. Like football game, game day, just open a bottle of Chardonnay. I'd have to say chicken wing. Not chicken wing. Not chicken. Yeah. I'd, I'd go with ribs. Yeah. I'm, I'm taking ribs. What would you pair this with at a movie? Yeah. It's I'm, Chardonnay. I'm thinking uh, Can you a butterfinger. Popcorn. Popcorn. Oh, popcorn. Dude. I'm dining. I do some uh, sea scallops seared with some uh, citrus beurre blanc. Wow. Yeah. Maybe a little like you've, uh, I've had that before, I thought. thought about this. Yeah. Done this before I think I have. What about you? Nice buttery whitefish. Yellowtail snapper or. Uh, that sounds good. Maybe a halibut. All right, so we got our 2010 Sangiovese. Sangio, how do you guys say it? Sangiovese. 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 You get some uh, some New York Italians in, you don't pronounce it right, you know, you might end up in a dumpster. Yeah, that's right. What are we smelling this? Me? Yeah, sun dried yeah. tomato. Sun dried tomato. Cranberry. Red cherries. Not too dark. Yeah. I get a little more darker cherry you do? for me. Okay. Um, and I, I get like that overly ripe strawberry. It's just a bright. Red wine. Fruit forward. Fruit red, forward. Red very, fruit. very bright, and I just think that that's a great adjective for it. BCS Championship game. We're open a bottle of Sangiovese. What are you guys pairing it with? Jake. Dude, I, like I said, I'd have to go pizza. I mean, ah. pizza, Sangiovese, all the way. Ostrich burgers. Dude, ooh, ostrich, ostrich burgers. burgers. Oh, dude, I'm doing it. Where is it on the couch? I'm doing it. Ostrich burgers. I'm gonna go even crazier than that with a poached duck egg oh on my top. God. What would you guys pair this with for movies, if you're watching a movie? I would pair this with Apocalypse Now. And food with that? <laughs> what about the food? Because yeah, yeah, there's nothing yeah. like the smell of Sangiovese in the morning. Yeah. This would, this would uh, be more of a milk chocolate. Uh, maybe a Hershey's or Nestle. What do we got for fine dining? Mine is a uh, Veal Asabuco. Veal Asabuco. I think this would go fantastic with that. San Ginovese. San Ginovese. San Ginovese. Actually, we do have a Gino here. Uh, oh, Gino. Gino. San Ginovese. Come on hey, over. Gina? Now, Gino. Just... Yeah. <laughs> Earlier, we were talking about game day. What would you have game day? I'm a, I'm a big fan of black bean burgers right now. Mm. Cheers, you guys. Happy New Year. Cheers. It's a San Ginovese. 2010. Awesome vintage. All right, back to work. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed the boys and their great tasting notes. Come in in February for Valentine's weekend for our fabulous chocolate buffet. 